Hello friends. I just got back from the mailbox and I have a letter from our friends at Uber. Did you know you could send a paper letter through the mail? I'll bet you didn't. Let's open it up and see what they sent us. I love getting mail. I'll bet you do too. Oh, look what they sent. Their paper surgical masks. I wonder what we're supposed to do with this. I know a place we can check because another place that I get mail is through my phone. Did you know you can get mail through the phone? Let's take a look and see if we got something from Uber. I'll bet we did. Oh, look at this. We have a message from our friends at Uber. And it says here, we're going to help each other keep safe with three simple steps. The first step is to wash our hands. Isn't it nice to have friends like Uber and the government to tell us to wash our hands? Did you know you should wash your hands? I'll bet you didn't. The next thing it says is to wear a face cover or a mask. That's why they sent the mask, because we're not smart enough to cover our mouth with our hands when we sneeze or cough. It's nice to have Uber. It also says, sit in the back seat and roll down your window. Did you know you could roll down your window? I'll bet you didn't. Back in the old days, windows were opened with a crank and you actually had to turn them with your hand. It was a lot of work. Now all we have to do is push a button and the window can go down or up. Most Uber riders, about half, know how to push a button. But you know, the phone's not the only place where we can get good information and find out the right things to do. We can also find out on a computer. Do you have a computer? I have a computer right here. We're going to turn on the computer and see what else we can find out. It says here, you should always sit in the back seat and you should always wear a seat belt. Seat belts are the law in most places. They were put in place by tyrannical overreaching governments who want to control every aspect of our lives. Governments make a lot of money with seat belt laws. Can you say power hungry government officials? I'll bet you can. Let's see if we can find a list of things that drivers like. Oh, do you like hugs? I'll bet you do. I'll bet your driver likes hugs too. Try it and see. Be sure to get out on the curb side of the car and only cross at the crosswalk. You can hold somebody's hand when crossing the street. Maybe you can hold the hand of your Uber driver. Maybe you can do this right after you hug them. Or maybe after you hug your driver, they'll call a friend to hold your hand. Always wear shoes in your Uber car. These men are crossing at the crosswalk, but one of them isn't wearing shoes. That's Paul. Paul is also smoking a cigarette. Paul is obviously a bad man. That's because Paul is a hippie. Can you say hippie? I'll bet you can. And now you know all the rules that Uber and the government think you are too stupid to figure out on your own. And it's time to say goodbye. It's a beautiful day in my Uber car. I hope you don't want me to drive you too far. I need to make a living. You entered my car. You're incredibly rude. You smell and you came with a bad attitude, but I need to make a living. There's 120 other things I'd rather do than be stuck in the traffic here in an Uber car with you. But let's make the most of this horrible ride. I'm kind of sorry I let you inside. It's come to an end. I'm sorry, my friend. It's time to leave my Uber. I don't want to shout. So get the hell out. It's time to leave my Uber. Thanks, friend.